Police this morning are investigating a deadly border patrol chase in Texas near San Antonio. At least five people were killed and several others hurt yesterday when an SUV overturned as it was being pursued by a border patrol agent. CBS's Hinadoba has more. The high speed chase that led to this deadly crash reached speeds of up to 100 miles an hour and ended with this SUV rolling over in Big Wells, Texas. 50 miles from the border with Mexico. What we could tell, the vehicle uh, ran off the road and caught gravel and then uh, tried to recorrect and then caused the vehicle to, to turn over several times. 14 people were inside the Chevrolet Suburban while being pursued by Border Patrol agents and the sheriff's deputy. Most of the passengers inside were ejected and five of them were killed. There was a big dust of dirt in the air and as soon as it settled, I just saw all the bodies. Amelia Flores, a nurse, was one of the first witnesses on the scene. They're just asking for help. Help me, help me. I hurt, you know, and it was just chaotic. Authorities believe many of the passengers were in the country illegally. U.S. Customs and Border Protection says a Border Patrol agent pursued the truck because they believed it was part of a three-vehicle smuggling event. Earlier, they had stopped two other vehicles and made arrests. But when they attempted to pull this one over, it ended in the fatal accident. The driver was not ejected. The deputy found him sitting upright in the seat. He was able to get him out of the vehicle and the driver was actually walking. The driver and one passenger are believed to be U.S. citizens and will likely face state and federal charges. Hanadoba, CBS News. And the fatal crash is now under investigation by Border Patrol, the Texas Department of Public Safety, the Dimmick County Sheriff's Office, Homeland Security Investigations and Customs and Border Protection's Office of Professional Responsibility.